About six months ago, I did something very stupid. How stupid, you may be wondering? Yeah, there, there's a thousand of these things. Now, being the good frog owner that I am, I did make a plan for these things. And at some point in the video, I even said this. Now, I'm gonna keep 100. This shack I made for him sucks. If you want me to make a much bigger palace for these guys, make sure to leave a like. And to my credit, I did. It actually sits right here next to my castle, and it's called the Royal Institute for Amphibious Development. But more importantly, this thing took me like a good two weeks to build. It, uh, it, it was not a video. I did it on Twitch, but it still counts. The only problem is I have literally a thousand frogs, and this thing fits, I don't know, maybe maybe a hundred? And I definitely don't have a hundred in here. So then I thought, okay, I can't leave them all in the other spot, so I guess I gotta make a second one. Hey, I did it again! The only problem is, somehow this one holds even fewer than the first one. And so in total, I have storage for maybe 150 frogs outside of their initial storage area. And because homeless frogs just aren't a good look, today I will be building what should be the final frog sanctuary I will need in my world. Also, did I mention this is gonna be out of emerald? Yeah, I'm not going cheap. What a great idea! And he's so handsome! Now, as stupid as this sounds, I really need to be careful where I put this thing. Uh, Tadpole, it's a bunch of frogs. What are they gonna do to you? Literally break my game. Le hold on, let's see what happens if I get close to it. Look at this riveting and clean gameplay. So wherever I put it, it needs to be somewhere that, like, I genuinely just don't care about. I was thinking of putting it, like, on one of these little islands over here, but I've already used so many of them, and the ones that remain are just tiny, so, like, I don't care. If I'm going to be making a literal emerald frog i would like it to be somewhere that i can go see it from time to time well wait hold on uh, i forgot i want to use emerald and gold for this i don't know that i have a lot of either of those if you don't recall i've made like three or four statues out of gold i just run through this stuff come on gold come on gold come on gold I'm poor. I mean, here's the thing. Two stacks and 11 still isn't nothing. That being said, I'm probably gonna need like a shulker box of this stuff. Oh, wait, I have a gold farm. Hold on. The big question is, I haven't been here in forever. Did I even leave it on when I left? Is it on? That is not a promising sight. It's not flashing. It's supposed to be flashing. Oh, that, that's, that's why it's not flashing. Okay. Well, uh, well, at least it still works. That's nice. Tadpole, I've been a good noodle. Please have gold. You bitch. I am screwed. Okay, that- who cares? That is not a me problem. If you know of an actual gold farm, please let me know in the comments, because this thing barely works. Well, if you just let fire spread on, it would actually work 90%- AH! Okay, that's gonna work a lot less now. <laughs> Gosh damn it! Whatever, I'm not fixing that right now. No, more importantly though, I think there's an area over here that I could put the frog. I've been leaving a little island, like, right there. The thing is, this isn't, like, the only island that I could build it on. However, I get the feeling this thing is probably gonna be about, like, 50 by 50 blocks. That's gonna fit right on the middle of this island very well, and I just don't think that it's gonna fit somewhere else. Also, like, come on, this is a view you just cannot pass up. Alright, fellas, you know what that means. Destroy and... Ecosystem! Woo! Oh, you kill that tree! Out here doing the large work. You know, an axe, a gun, fire, does it matter how I get rid of these trees? Like, I'm not doing this to get the wood. More importantly, though, I've come to the realization I don't want or need to clear out this entire island. I think the move from here, I want to leave at least some of them. However I do it, I basically just want to clear it out so I can see what I have there, but I want it to be surrounded by trees. Oh, oh my gosh, it's natural. I don't care. I've been cutting wood for an hour and a half. I'm so sick of this. Actually, at this point, I may as well, let's just start placing down some of this gold. So the basic outline, I think I want to do like a... 50 by 50 pyramid? I, like, vaguely want to use amethyst. Yeah, I'm not dead set on that. That might turn out ugly. I don't know. I mean, it's a box made out of gold. I don't know what I expected. I'll tell you what I didn't expect, though. The amount of dirt that I have to get out of this area is ridiculous. I'm fairly confident, like, all of the dirt that is within this box, yeah, that's gonna have to go. That's not a now problem. What I want to do now, you've already seen, I'm not exactly rich in the gold department. However, the amethyst fairy has been oh so kind to me. I have a lot of amethyst. It's gonna be yellow and purple. I don't know if that'll look good. I just want to try it out here. I mean, the worst that happens is it just looks like crap. Crap. The intelligent, capitalist, responsible tadpole in me is going, Hey, you have, like, so much amethyst, let's just do that. But that slick-talking American in me knows that gold is nice. I think I'm just a chump for gold- Crap! Okay, well, hold on. No, I left the gold farm on while I was gone. No, I did not actually break it. You shut up. Also, like, I know that it looks like I've done nothing. This has been, like, four hours of working on that. Don't get all uppity at me that I don't have anything done. I'm the one doing it.
Oh, let me scooch on past you there. Hi, editing tadpole here. Now, I could just gaslight you for the rest of this video. You know that's crazy, right? I just love how you're always wrong. But instead, I'm gonna be upfront right here. Throughout the video, you're gonna notice my gold changes a lot. If you're a crazy person, you think the amount of gold I currently have is enough. But if I'm being honest, it took so many trips back to that stupid gold farm. I also did end up finding more gold elsewhere in my world, but that was literally because I ran to my new city because I got bored. Suffice it to say, don't ask where the gold came from or else this video is gonna be three times times as long. Anyway, back to the video. Okay, this should be the last of the gold that I had to replace. And with any luck? Oh, that's so much nicer. Okay, yeah, I should have known that like purple and yellow is gonna be a weird look. Still though, because I brought the amethyst over, I may as well, let's just use it for like the top. Cause I mean, like what is a frog gonna sit on? He's not sitting on gold. It would hurt his little bottom. Then again, he's probably also not sitting on amethyst, but I don't care. Ugh, wait, hold on a minute. Like, I, is this big enough to do what I want with it? And before you go, tadpole, we get it. That's what your wife says every night. First of all, I'm not married. No, more importantly though, I know this frog is going to be massive. I probably should have counted this out ahead of time. I'm trying to make it like roughly twice as large as the last frog statue I made. No, this is not the first time I've done this. But I also don't really know how big that one is, so we're kind of just winging it. This was not a good idea. Also, speaking of the last one, we called the last one Jerome. If you have a good name for a freaking emerald frog, let me know in the comments. I suck at naming these things. You guys are usually 10 times better. We have full free speech laws here. You talk shit on the king or the queen, they can like toss you in the, in the old jail. I can say anything I want. Look at this. Case in point, Joe Biden balls. And I'm proud to be an American. Anyway, with this, we are essentially done with the gold and the amethyst. Hey, the pyramid may not be 100%. I don't care. Like, I love that as well. I don't know how far along we are in the video. The main purpose of this was not to make a freaking gold pyramid. It's meant for the emerald frog. <laughs> That reminds me, this video is called Emerald Frog. Uh, quick question, I do we have emeralds? <laughs> Hold on, I have a little villager area in the Amethyst Mountain. Let's go check that first. Why do all of my chests make me look like a hoarder? Okay, it's not in these, I'm not seeing it. Maybe they're inside? I don't hate that I have this, but that's not what I'm looking for. Well, it's like my dad always taught me, if at first you don't succeed, try again. But if that doesn't work, you're gonna give me your emeralds and you're gonna give them to me right now. And if you don't, I'm gonna shoot one of these kids. I'm not actually gonna kill you today, but you're lucky. How does one get a Fletcher? Hi, children! Who wants to be a Fletcher? Okay, if I don't want this to take literally like eight hours of getting those stupid emeralds, please tell me I just have some sitting over here. Ooh, that's not good! Wait, do I have any over- what would it be? WHEN DID I GET THIS?! You know what? Beggars can't be choo- Why am I doing this? Just take the whole box. Beggars can't be choosers, my boys. And I'm choosing to be thankful right now. Okay, to be fair- Oh, it's not nighttime. Whatever, I don't care. You would think at this point I would know, hey, dumbass, you have shulker boxes of emeralds. I'm telling you, after eight years, look at this. I can't name what's in half of these chests. It's not my fault. I'm a victim of how old my world is. So, my basic rule of thumb with this thing is, compared to the last frog that I made- I'm gonna show it off just in case you forgot. Because it's literally right over here. That's the beauty. Is it? There he is. It's King Jerome. All hail his majesty, King Jerome. Now, more importantly, I didn't come over here just for the vanity sake of it. I mean, come on. This thing is beautiful. Go check it out. I made it into a video. More importantly, though, I need to figure out what are his dimensions. So, I'll round up. We'll call that about 30 by 25-ish. Oh, I thought he was like a full-on square. Okay, that's whatever. So, essentially, what I'm going to be doing is I'm literally just going to be doubling the exact size of this bad boy. So, if he looks good here... Oh, uh, he'll be he'll be great when he's twice as big. Chief, I feel like Bob the Builder right now. I have not done this much counting since like literally middle school. I mean, the nice thing is I have like way too much emerald, way too much iron anyway. Like, oh no, if I miscalculate, it's not the end of the world. I'm not gonna run out. That being said, I'm getting so ahead of myself. How much do I even have done? Oh, Chief, I really got ahead of myself. I mean, that being said, I still have like well over half of the frogs still left to do. It's not the craziest thing in the world. Luckily for me, I'm going through a decent amount of emerald, but I'm not going through nearly enough that I'm going to run out. We're fine in that department. What really concerns me is right here down the middle. If I do ever actually want to do something with this, I need to clear this area out. Ah, oh, shoot. Okay, first things first, let's finish up the frog. I don't know why I did something like this. Hey, if you made it this far, please leave a like. Uh 
Uh-oh, Badman Tadpole again. Look, I'll be honest with you, you be honest with me. We do not care that I cleared out the inside of this pyramid. And if you do, go watch it on Twitch. That's where I did all this live. Did I say that already? I, who cares? Basically, when I was done with that, I'm like, hey, we're good to go. I finished up the temple. But then I forgot. I did this specifically for frogs. So I gave myself one last job. Get up, lard asses. We're going. Okay, before we get too far, let me say something. This is a free country. That means I'm free to leave you behind. So break off the lead and you just die. No, no, please take your time. I have nothing but patience. I will put you in a pan. All right, everybody, down to my basement. Get in my basement. I have a portal down here. That, I know how that sounds, but it's a portal to hell, so it's fine. Okay, if I'm being responsible about this, I can't take them all at once. We're gonna have to take them in, like, individual batches. I will say, I feel really bad that they're just sort of getting drug along behind me, but... What are you gonna do? You guys suck at paying attention to one another. I think we lost one. Okay, buddy, you are the only one I can find. I should be missing another. Is he back in the nether still? Go through the portal. Go through the portal. Is this dude immortal? What is going on? Hello? What the shit? No! 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 Get no! Please! 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 Okay, never mind. You are just the freaking lord of all the frogs. You're you're staying in hell, I guess. Congrats. All right, everybody else, we gotta go on a voyage. And by a voyage, I mean be quick. These things will kill you. Well, they'll kill me. They probably won't touch you, but... Hey, I'm a frog too. And welcome to your new home. So, okay, at this point, I've essentially done what I set out to do. In a normal video, I would probably just come out here, do a nice flyover of the emerald frog. And I'd say that's that. But the end goal of this video was to get all of the frogs over here. And it took me half an hour to get literally seven of them. So I have an idea. Instead of physically moving the frogs myself, let's emotionally move them and they'll come here themselves through good old-fashioned patriotism. Howdy, I'm Tendon Tadpole, and I'm out here in God's country. A place where a man's only allegiance is to his frog, and where we settle our issues with a gun. Now the city slicker Minecrafters among you gon' tell you it ain't right that I'm putting a thousand frogs in a gold pyramid under an emerald frog. Well last I checked, this was God's country. If you're a true patriot who believes that a man should be able to do whatever he damn well pleases underneath that emerald frog, go ahead and like this video. Y'all stay safe now, you hear?